Hey everybody, this is Pastor Larry Tiz and Aviva Shalom, one of our grand sugars. Say hi. hi. And you know, in ancient Hebrew, there's no word for coincidence. Right. Now, we're filming this from our kitchen in, in our home. And as we're filming this, Tiz says, look over your shoulder. And in the living room, we have, of course, Daystar on. And all of a sudden, we look over right now, Tiz and I are teaching about Passover yes. and the blood of the Lamb. That's not a coincidence. That is a message yes. to you. Let me read what we just saw on television that I was reading from the studio. Exodus chapter 12, verse 22. And you shall take a bunch of hyssop, dip it in the blood that is in the basin, strike the lintel and the two door doorposts with the blood that is in the basin, and none of you shall go out of the door of his house until morning. They're in isolation. They're in isolation, but they're in isolation to receive a miracle from God. Verse 23, for the Lord will pass through to strike the Egyptians, but when he sees the blood on the lintel and on the two doorposts, the Lord will pass over the door and not allow the destroyer to come into your houses to strike you. You know, this is Friday. We're getting ready for Shabbat. I'm going to be teaching tonight live from the church to you on stream on the seven places that Jesus shed his blood. Obviously, the most important thing everyone's thinking about is that no plague yes. shall come Absolutely. into your household. But tonight, I want you to understand that the Lamb of God, Jesus, didn't just shed his blood one time, but shed his blood seven different times. The number seven in Hebrew is the number of completion. And so I want you to understand, the blood of Jesus is gonna protect you from sickness, but it's gonna protect you and bless you in every area of your life. Revelation said, they overcame the enemy by the blood of the Lamb and the word of their testimony. It's not a coincidence that you're sitting here with Tiz and myself and Aviva Shalom, and you know Tiz's testimony where God defeated cancer. If God can de defeat cancer in Tiz and God can defeat cancer in Lion, can you imagine the victory, the blood of the Lamb and the word of the testimony the victory that we've seen, that anointing is coming to you yes. and your family. So tonight, from our family to your Shabbat Shalom, Shabbat Shalom. join us live on stream as yes. we cover you with the seven places yes. the Lamb of God shed His blood. Yes. We love you guys. Happy Passover, everybody. Happy Passover and Shabbat Shalom.